All right. Uh, okay, hold on a second. There we go. Oh, I guess. Wait, please. Oh, no, yeah, you can see it. Okay, cool. <laughs> it wasn't showing up properly on my end. What's up, everybody? How are you guys doing? Sorry for the slightly late start. I was running into troubles with OBS. I'm still running into troubles with OBS. Um, for some reason, I can't get my alert box to work properly. I don't, I don't, I don't understand why. Um, I'm gonna have to contact support later on and ask them about what's up. So I'm just gonna have to deal with it today. But what's everybody? How are you guys doing? Uh, let me see. Am I able to see who's in the chat? Here. I don't think I can. Oh well. I know I can do it on Twitch, but I want to do it on Twitch. Okay. But anyways, let's get started. I already pulled. I already did my pulls, by the way. I uh. I actually got Luxor. Oh my god! <laughs> I already got I got Luxor on my second pull, actually, um, which was kind of nice. So I was able to easily save some jewels. I get, I, you guys can't see how many jewels I have. Where is it? Um, boom! There you guys see. See, I have like twelve thousand ish jewels now. So I was able to save quite a bit. It was nice. It was nice. Oh. Boy, let's get started. I've, I, I've been hearing people have been getting, uh, been struggling with this, which makes sense. It is a random target, which kind of sucks. Um, after, after I do Orga 13, I'll probably, I'll probably end up, uh, doing a bit of PVP. Where is the bot so I can know if Luxord is good? Uh, it's, you got commands. It's, it's the exclamation point commands. Oh, I forgot to actually fill that out. Hold on, let me actually update that real quick. And what's up, what's up, Chris? Let me update that real quick. Commands. Do I have Luxord? I do have Luxord on there. Okay. Let me edit the Luxord command. Da -da 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 -da. Welcome everybody new to the stream, by the way, or maybe not new, but you know, welcome. Just give me a second. I'm writing out real quick uh, some of the commands for you guys to use. Just I'm just updating one of them.
All right, now it should be updated. I believe all the other commands are the same now. All right, let's get started. Um, in case any of you are wondering, the commands. There you go. Oh, all right. So I haven't done these yet, obviously. Um, I know that you're only able to allow random target medals, though. Uh, I prepped my setup already in advance. This is what I'm planning to use. Don't know how well it's going to go, but we'll figure it out, I guess. So we'll go ahead and start with the first one. Let's see. I have in my party, I have Snoots's Bob and Jack check, which is going to help a lot. My only concern for this quest is gauges. Like, I don't know if gauges is going to become a problem or not. Hey, the dark dude. Thank you so much for the follow. Um, where is it? There it is. His has extra tech. Oh my God. There we go. Oh, they're not. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I was like, did the, the command not pop up? So I've seen his attack from some videos, like for the metal animation, and I'm just assuming his actual attack in game is the same exact thing. The five counters is, I feel like it's gonna be the hardest part. Like, I, I don't think there are, there's no, there's no random target medals that avoid counters, is there? Off the top of my head. At least I don't think there is. I've heard some people have been getting stuck on stages eight and nine. Some people can't even get past the first few stages just because of the fact like there is not that many good random target medals in the game that like weren't available purely from high score challenge or VIP, which kind of sucks. Luckily, Lingering Will is one of those like few free to play medals that like you can use for this event. So our first trait medal. My main concern is going to be uh, because of the fact that my Psyx has extra attack. Somebody else have it? Yeah, no. Just my Psyx has extra attack. I'm worried if that's going to become a problem. I'm hoping not. But we'll see. What's up, Smug Pup? How you doing? Smug Pug Pup. Welcome, everybody, by the way, to the stream. Hope you're all having a fantastic day so far. Oh, fuck okay. it. Who? So, what is this? Stage three? Stage four? Stage four. Mm -hmm. 
good man have like myself i'm doing pretty good i got a lot to work to do today i got way too much to do today so like uh after this stream obviously i need to make it the banner advice video in regards to luxord um and then I need to make a, uh, I'm considering whether or not to make a guide video for this event. I, I, like, I'm not too sure. Like, there's not really like too many options you can use for this event. I don't know, I'm gonna figure that one out. But I gotta start working on tomorrow's Kingdom Key video as well. And I have some articles that I still need to write as well. I didn't really have time to work on those yesterday. And I feel like I'm not going to have time to do them today either. So it's more like I'm trying to figure out when am I going to have time to do these. But yeah, I just have a lot of work today. I'm doing good though in the meantime. I, I find it interesting how they give you three minutes to complete it. I don't understand why. He's not Demix. He didn't have a time limit. Oh, no, wait. He did have a time limit, didn't he? Yeah, no, I think he did have a time limit in Kingdom Hearts 2, didn't he? Because he's making you play a game and stuff. I'm able to complete even stage one, but I've just come to accept it now. Yeah. I mean... Yeah, no, like this, this is this this event has probably got to be one of the most unfair to players. Like I like I understand the theme, but like I don't know. I feel like they could have done it differently, make it a little bit more enjoyable, if that makes sense. Like the fact that you're restricted to just random target medals doesn't feel that great. If I can get extra attack on my Luxord though, oh, that's gonna be so nice. It's gonna be so nice. Let's see. Am I stage seven already? Like this, this hasn't felt too difficult just yet. Yeah, this event is quite peculiar. See, this is what I'm worried about. I'm worried about the extra attack from Psyx. I'm hoping that doesn't become a problem. One way putting it. Great. All right, we're on stage eight. Haven't had too many problems just yet. Oh my God. <laughs> of course, right when I say that, a ton of enemies just show up out of nowhere all of a sudden. So this is what I'm going to do about Sykes thing. 
Uh, we'll tap you. We'll continue the auto from here. That's cool. That's cool. That's pretty cool. I'm just glad none of my none of the random target metals HP have to be dependent off of uh, HP. Wait, that doesn't make sense. None of the metals damage are dependent on HP. That's what I meant to say. Not exactly difficult, but the condition makes it absolutely. Yeah, th that's what I'm saying. Like, I mean, even even for people who are like not free to play, it can still be kind of a drag. Cause I, I, I'm I'm willing to bet there's a lot of people who saw like a bunch of the random target medals from VIP and were just like, eh, I'm gonna skip that because that doesn't look very good. Like, I'm willing to bet that's a lot of people. <laughs> like like Soren Palace, for example. No, Roxas and Palace, my bad. Like, Roxas and Palace, like, he's fantastic for this event. But I'm willing to bet a lot of people skipped him. Uh, granted, he has a pretty decent multiplier, though. Even at 7-star, he has a pretty decent multiplier. So you, could, you can even use him as a damage metal, which is kind of interesting. But, oh well. I saw a veteran free to play usually getting to quest nine, but this time around I see difficult for most of them getting to three to four. Yeah, I'm gonna see if it's possible how far I can get. Like with just free to play type medals. I'm curious to see how that would go. I'm not too sure. I'll do that like afterwards though. Okay, nice. Nice, I didn't hit him yet. Nice. Now I hit him. Alright, we might actually get the Bob and Jack Jack. Oh yeah, we'll barely get the Bob and Jack Jack. I mean, cons actually, now that I think about it, most of my setup is free to play already. I just realized that. The only thing not free to play about my setup is my Toon Roxas and Pals. But for that, I could easily just use Luxord. Because my Lingering Will already provides plus five speed buffs, anyways. So it's like, it's not that big of a deal. Like, look. Like, the little, the only thing not free to play about this setup is, is Toon Rocks is about, and that's it. Um, and I could just replace him with Luxor. Granted, I would be losing out on some upright strength at the very beginning. And just a slight amount of speed strength, but I don't think it would make too much of a difference. Yeah. Yeah, I don't I don't think it would take make too much of a difference. Super struggling with this because right now I don't have Psy X B. Boss Semnus, four scar at seven star. Oh gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, you definitely yeah, seven stars are kinda necessary. If I end up not being able to beat this event, I'm pretty, like, right now, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to beat it once, uh, once PvP reset happens. Because I'm expecting to, at the very least, get top 500, um, for this week. And if I'm lucky, I can probably, I can probably secure a spot in top 100. I'm able to get, I'm able to get in the top 100 bracket. It's just a matter of, like, trying to get that spot during, like, the last 30 minutes before reset. That's that's the tricky part. I just followed my Zach B. 
Mistakes have been made? Wait, what's wrong with evolving your Zack B? Oh, I forgot there's a timer. Damn it. Okay, rip. I'm pretty sure I should be able to kill him. Yeah, no, definitely. me I just lack a random target buffer gotcha um I mean you could get luck luxord assuming you have the jewels of course oops I setup is on the starlight for the event yeah I'm pretty sure everyone's best setup is on the starlight for this event Let's just continue. Now, I don't have a reverse power random target to do enough damage. Um, well, you could try using in the meantime. I know Psyx B is one. I believe Axel B is another random target metal uh, from the past. That could be an option. That's also a, a power buffer. Doesn't do strength, unfortunately, but. It does do power buffs. Looks like you're getting closer to finishing. Yeah, like so far I haven't been really having any issues with it so far. Like I feel it's coming soon, but I'm still kind of just waiting. Oof, that's unlucky. I already hit him twice. Oh my god. No, I didn't want to use it again. God damn. I keep hitting him. Rip. That was unlucky. I think part of the worst part about this event too is that you can't use copy metals. Like you have to use purely random target metals. I have Luxord 7 star. He hits hard, but it might be because I got the magic boosters. Ooh. I mean, he's going to hit hard regardless. Luxord is a strong metal. Um, like, like, even on his low end, he's still pretty strong. He hits stronger than a prime metal. Um, and I'm not finished confirming it just yet, but, like, I'm pretty damn sure that critical hit perks increase this, increases the chances of you actually hitting the high end of his multiplier. Pretty damn sure, because uh, I've already tested it a hundred. I've already like did a, a hundred and eighty tests with a crit metal, uh, with with the crit perks equipped, just to see where's got where like whether it's a fucker or not. And I am getting more crits, and the percentage is pretty much about equal to what it should be uh, with the crit perks. So. I'm pretty certain, like, I, I need to do another 100 or two uh, more tests before I can be like, yeah, no, I, I, I pretty solid case that they help out. Uh, but even just with 180, like, I'm pretty certain that crit perks help increase the chances. Let's see. This event is either really easy if you go, or really hard, pretty much. Since we have just two medals with critical hit condition, uh, well, now we have three medals, I believe, officially. We have Setzer, Luxord B, and now, obviously, Luxord Plus. I don't think there's any more. There might be more, for all I know, but at least those are the main ones that I'm, that I can recall. So 
So, so far, so good. I'm not hiding a Luxord. Nice. Okay, that's fine. At least we'll be able to use Bob and Jack Jack. I'm not gonna lie, it would be kind of cool if they turned us into a card like they do in Kingdom Hearts 2. Like, like uh, if you make his counters run out or something, like, or revenge counter, just something. Like, every other attack, he turns into a card. That'd be kind of cool. Just something. Hey, Meat Stack, thank you so much for the subscribe, man. Come on, I'll load up. Oh, wait, that's on YouTube. Never mind. At least you're having an easy time now. Yeah. I was, I was kind of figuring it would be a little bit harder. Even with the medals, like, I thought it would be a little bit harder, but I guess not. I think I've only died once in each of these stages so far. I haven't died a second time. I haven't needed second chance yet. Yeah, and yeah, that's one of the things I need to uh, take care of today too. Is uh, well, not, or this weekend I should say the raid bosses. I need to finish those those boards. I pretty much just been like not caring about doing them during the week, and I'm just saving for the weekend. Like, I'm not gonna wait for certain times of the day to do it. Like, that's that's annoying. I would much rather just be able to like grind it all in like one sitting. Um, or mo or a good chunk of it in one sitting rather than like having to wait five hours each day just to do it oh that's unfortunate that's unfortunate i hope this isn't behind him okay, nice this might hit him yep Rip. Ooh. Close. So that was the first time I actually need second chance. This is so much easier than I expected. Oh wait, was that stage 13? Oh, <laughs> I thought that was stage 11 or 12. I didn't know it was 13. It's a little disappointing. I thought, it, I don't know. I, I, from what I was hearing, I thought it was going to be so much more difficult, even with the medals. I thought it was going to be much more difficult. That wasn't nearly as exciting as I thought it was going to be. Kind of sucks. Rip. Well, I mean... I guess I might as well, yeah, easy 5k. Wait, why does it say, wait, why does it say, oh, event boards. How many coins did I get from that? 
Oh, I got a pretty good chunk. Let me finish getting these boosters. Okay, at least it's only at least I got the ten percent of this, which is what I need. So I need what twenty five more coins to get these la this last booster. I'm I'm kind of expecting and hoping that I think what they're gonna end up doing is that I'm expecting possibly a raid whenever raid week competitive raid week comes up this month i'm expecting that entire week like every time you farm the the raid boss it'll give you event coins i have a feeling that's what they're gonna do in which case i wouldn't mind because you guys do you guys see how many raid boards i still have i mean event boards i still have left like i still have quite a bit left oh i can unlock that But yeah, we still have quite a bit left. Isn't Raid Week in JP right now? I think so. Or at least I heard about it. I, I don't remember who I heard it from or what I heard it from. If you say if it say it's not, then you probably know a bit more than me. I don't play JP. I just kind of watch the announcements. All right. Oh well. I'm gonna I'm gonna do my trait rolls. See what I get. I don't think I have an. Well, I'm most likely not gonna have enough mirrors. <laughs> oh, it doesn't matter. I can't have open right now, anyways. Whatever. It's coming to JP. Oh, it's okay. So, uh, so yeah, on Monday then. Monday or Tuesday. All right, let's freeze this guy though. seconds. Alright, here we go. Three, two, one. Yo. It's a pretty low roll. Ooh, damage. Okay. Wait, he's oh he's random target. Okay, that's not that's not that bad. Oh. I didn't wait. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought we had a guilt campaign for a second. I was like, what? Okay, that's a little bit better. Aerial is nice. Okay, it's getting better. <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, it's just getting better, which is nice. Oh my god, how many aerials am I gonna get? <laughs> I kinda don't wanna roll this last one. Ariana just wants to Yeah, no, I like like I only wish that uh minus sixty traits stack. Like that would be That'd be fantastic, but Ugh. So is he how many hits does he do? He does seven hits, okay, never mind. Never mind. High score challenge? Wait, what? What are you talking about? 
What are you talking about, Chris? What do you mean? What do you mean high score challenge or not? I I'm not gonna make it air only for the memes. All right, like that's terrible. That's a terrible thought. Won't you save the trait metaphor? Oh no, I don't need to. I mean, I might as well. All right, well, there we go. I wasn't nearly as eventful as I thought I was gonna be. Chances are, to be like quite realistically, if they, if he ends up being part of the high score challenge, if we happen to get another one anytime soon, he'll probably end up being like a somewhat low percentage or mid percentage medal. He's not gonna be high percentage, most likely. I'm really, I'm really waiting for the Zaldan Plus or Lark. I'm hoping Lark Scene is a stronger speed reverse metal. That would be nice. Speed reverse kind of needs some love a little bit in terms of like the AOE department. I think. I'm not too sure off the top of my head now. But, oh well. I guess I'm just going to go ahead and do PvP real quick then. Um, this stream is going to actually end up being a whole lot shorter than I thought it was going to be. Usually these end up taking like a couple hours or a few hours, but we we did that easily within an hour. Did you, yeah, we, I just finished the Luxord event. It was a little way more easier than I was expecting it to be. Actually, what I could do, what I could do just for, just for shits and giggles is see if I can beat it with just the... With just a free to play setup. So let me just take a Toon Soren, pals. I can easily just replace that with Luxor and see how that does. Just take your out. Boom. Oh, yeah, he came with Attack Boost 5 Max and Lux Plus, which is like. Oh, that's actually perfect! He came with Lux Plus and he has a Ray Trait. Okay. Alright, that's, you know, that's not that bad. <laughs> That's not that bad. Not that bad. Yeah, just... Just try it like that. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need a second chance on one of these medals. You know what? You know what? I might as well just swap out Scar. For something. Um, random targets. I have a second chance on it. Okay, cool. I guess this is what we'll do. All right. Okay, maybe not. Whatever. We'll just keep Scar. Oh, I don't have a skill in you. I'll use Setzer. All he says, I'll not put second chance on him. Sure. It's not the highest skill percentage, but whatever. They all laughed at you when you bought the Toon Roxas VIP medal. You laughed at that when you beat the event. <laughs> I did without Toon Roxas. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure it's, you can do it without Toon Roxas. Um, like, I, I'm pretty much using a free-to-play setup. Just just with Toon Roxas. And, like, this time I'm trying to use it without Toon Roxas just to see how it goes. Um, and, yeah, same thing. Teen Roxas can easily be replaced with Sykes Plus. I mean, it can easily be replaced with Luxord Plus, too. Either one. Um, Key Art 15 and Aqua and Stitch. I mean, I do too, but I didn't use it in my setup. 
I, I'm most of my setup is quite honestly just high score challenge medals. Actually, no, not even. Like ig ignoring the friend medal because like you can't exactly always get to that. Um, I have Illustrated Diz and King Triton. Those are my high score challenge medals. Then I have Luxord Plus and Psyx Plus. Those are Orc 13 medals. And then I just have a random Lingering Will. Actually, no, I was using Scar before too. That's also. Wait, was Scar a high score challenge? I think Scar was high score challenge, right? I want to say Scar was high, high score challenge. I keep forgetting I'm on a timer. Is Luxord even worth pulling? I I feel like he is. Um, I know the uncertainty of his ability is making people hesitate about it, but overall, I think I think I think it is worth pulling for. Whether or not you should pull for it is a completely different question. Um, but is it does it have value of being does it have value to be pulled for? Then I would say yeah. Um, especially if we ever get more critical hit perks in the future, he's only going to get better. Just because, like, I am pretty damn sure that critical hit perks actually do influence his ability. Like, make it more likely to reach the high end of his multiplier. On global came and debut the... Okay, that's where the confusion was. I didn't have a second. I'm pretty. Wait, what? How much health did I have? Personally, for me, I try to go for as many of this organization 13 medals as possible just because of the fact that we're not going to see them anytime soon. Um, they'll probably end up doing, very possibly, doing the, the whole thing that they did before with like the the last few where like they have a return event to get free copies of the metal they might do that which would be nice but i don't know we'll see they won't be dotted though i think which well, shouldn't be a big problem because you could just save them because in brooms for that yeah. we're just gonna keep going to high onto second chance triggers Okay, it didn't hit him. Okay, that one hit him. It's not hitting the other guy. Thank you. That barely does any damage. Not gonna lie, I like the animation. The animation is pretty cool. Kind of concerned about my pages. Oh, oh, okay, we beat him. <laughs> All right, so well, we just confirmed it. It's completely possible to free to play play it. I mean, free to play it. Huh. Okay, that was it. Good stuff. Did I do this already? Yeah, I did. Ugh. Oh, just one day left. Okay, oops. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm expecting them on Monday to have some type of new event to get more event coins. Oh. Yeah, I didn't need second chance for that one. Which is interesting. But, oh well. I'm gonna go ahead. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm actually gonna reset the stream. So I can change the title of the stream and stuff. 
Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and do some of my PvP. I'm going to do my PvP for today. Just get that out of the way. Uh, I, I'm gonna, I, I also want to reset it just so I can like actually download the stream later on and just upload it to YouTube. So I'll be right back. Just uh, stick around for a couple seconds and I'll be, I'll be right back. Right. I'll see you guys in a second. <laughs> 